Hi, this is Angela Bull. I'm the CEO of the Independent Book Publishers Association, and I'm here on the floor of Book Expo America 2016 in Chicago, Illinois, talking to one of our amazing members at IVPA, Michael Higgins. We're here to talk about his new book out from the International Exploration Society. It's called Exploring Wine Regions and focuses on Argentina. And it's a very interesting, beautifully illustrated book. So why don't you tell us a little about it? Well, thanks, Angela. It's nice to be here with you. So the book series, I should maybe say first, is a series of 11 books covering the top wine countries of the world. And so Argentina is one of those top 11. In fact, what makes this book interesting as a first book is that Argentina really wasn't on the map very long ago. And because of Malbec and because of their ability to produce it in such extraordinary ways, they become the fifth largest wine region in the world. Wow. And to put that in perspective, the United States is fourth. Wow. So yeah. this, is, uh, this is very exciting what's going on in Argentina. So this first book is 352 pages of exploring Argentina's wine regions, the top three wine regions, which is Mendoza. Most people have heard of Mendoza because that's the primary wine region. And also Salta, which is in the northwest of Argentina. And this is very high elevation vineyards. And then to the south is Patagonia, which is another really great place to grow grapes for the, the Pinot Noir, the cool, Great. Nice. Yes. So if you love wine, if you love travel, this is a great book to start exploring with. It is. Right. And then, so, but there are, there are a lot of books about wine. There's a lot of books about Argentina. There's a lot of books about exploring. This book is unique, though, in its category. What makes it unique in its category? Wow, there's a lot of reasons why it's unique. And, and first of all, with wine books, they're typically about the bottles. Mm -hmm. They're about the wines themselves and not about the wine regions, which is what this book is about. And then when it comes to travel books, they're about the destination in general, like maybe Argentina in general. And they may or may not have information about wine regions, and if they do, it's a small part of it. With this book, it's focused on the wine regions. This is, this is both a beautiful coffee table book as well as a specific travel guide where you can go to Argentina and I have really opened the doors and introduced my readers uh, to the inside track of exploring those wine regions, the people to see and the places to go and the things to do. And Argentina was a deliberate choice. So you mentioned this is the first book in a series of 11. So there's 10 more regions to be covered by the time you're done. Yes. Exhaustive work. I'm sure you'll be fine drinking wine all over the world to I get don't your have research a done. That. You'll yeah. be all right. But why did you pick Argentina? You talked a little bit about it. Is there anything else about the region that's special? Have you ever tasted a Malbec? I have. Oh, so. I love Malbec. That's the great place to start then. It is. And I was, I was at home in restaurants drinking Malbec, realizing that every Molbeck I drank was great. Mm -hmm. And so the premise to this book is I've never met a Molbeck I didn't like. <laughs> and I went to Argentina to figure out why. And you are the photographer as well as the author. So you've covered That's this. Right. And what, um, what makes you able? So why Argentina? Have you tried Malbec? Why you? Why are you the one to cover this book? I love wine. I love travel. And the book, as you noticed, is very much about photography. I actually have a degree in photography from a very prestigious school. And I've spent the last 20 years in the publishing business, publishing travel magazines. So these travel magazines have wine lovers. 80% of them are wine lovers. So what's happened for me over the last 20 years is I'm going to wine regions. I've been learning this for 20 years and producing stories in our magazine. And That's great. So now it's a book series focused on this wonderful topic. And as a photographer of this book, you were very busy. There are over 500, there are literally hundreds of photographs in this book. Are there any that are particularly interesting to you, that really speak to you? You're right. I actually spent 13 weeks in Argentina doing these photographs, and there's over 550 in this book. 
and, and I still love looking at it because it makes me want to go there, like this one here, the vineyards and the Andes in the background. And then here's another one. That's an amazing wine cellar. And so I get into not just the wine regions, but the wineries themselves, the information to be able to go to those wineries, where you can stay in nice little resorts that are in the vineyards, restaurants to go to. It's, it's, it's a total experience. It's a total immersive experience. It is. In Argentina wine. Exactly right. Wonderful. Well, I appreciate that you're sharing that knowledge, that you've taken what you've learned over 20 years and you're publishing it in this series of books. I know this book is available in October, right. so it's perfect for holiday gifts. It's a beautiful book. We'll make sure that we get some images in here. And it's available uh, on Amazon, Barnes & Noble, and if uh, you wanted to buy it through a wholesaler, you could get it through Ingram. So congratulations. Right. It's a beautiful book. Thank I wish you, you all much. the best with it. Thank you. Thank you.